I'm doing a quick video before my nail client comes so it won't be a massively long one um, first of all welcome to my channel I am kitten up kitten um, thank you for joining me today I am doing my section for DIY DP 24 so this is kind of like a little whip video for you to work along with whether you're taking part in the uh, in the event or not um, all details that you may need will be in the description box below. If you are brand new and you have no idea what this is, um, very quickly I am doing a conversion project where I am using a blank gridded canvas and I'm using a chart. Um, it is a cross stitch chart and I'm using that to build my pattern. Um, it's an event that I do every year and uh, that's what we're doing. If you would like to see normal whips, please do have a look at my other videos. And if you would consider subscribing, it would be very much appreciated because uh, the more people that subscribe, the busier the channel gets. And that is what I would like. It's only a small little channel, not very many at all. Um, so it is day 12. Um, I am currently, I've just finished work, so I've managed to get myself into something a little bit more comfortable, should we say. Um, that should be up there like that. That was a mistake I made, caught that already. Last night was the live update. Um, I apologise that it was a little bit subdued it's not the same i miss my penny <laughs> i do lives are not the same without her um but as you know she is dealing with her own horrendous shit right now so the last thing she needs to be doing is worrying about whether i do a bloody live or not um so big hugs and kisses sent out to penny um and thank you to everyone who came on the live last night um, I do like doing the lives. I just wasn't feeling it very much yesterday. Uh, you know, I sort of, I've had enough. I've had enough of the pain. I've had enough of always feeling like I'm moaning about something. I'm sure my husband would say the same thing. Um, so I am working on this little section here to get this bit done. Um, as I said last night on the live, we are waiting to have a carpet delivered and fitted on Friday. Um, Ashley's off work Friday and Monday and we were originally going to be going away for the weekend. But um, because we paid out for this boiler and now a new carpet and furniture, we decided to postpone. So Ashley's having the time off anyway. Um, so we'll have the weekend together and we'll have Monday. We're just not going away because, you know, got to pay them bills first. <laughs> Simple as that. If you can't afford to go, you can't afford to go. Um, so it means that it's going to be very, very busy. I am going to warn you now that there is a chance that I may not have a video for Thursday um, because I will be coming home from work Thursday and we will be moving all of the furniture out because they're coming at lunchtime on Friday. So we're moving everything out, including the old sofa bed, which has to go down to the cabin. So um, if I don't get a chance to do a video, I might be fine. I might be fine. I may be able to do a video tomorrow to put up Thursday, but just in case. Um, worst case scenario, you may end up with a video of me framing my polar express canvas but there we go i'll do my best um so i haven't got too many colors to do on this i i have already if i can get them to highlight i'm just having a look to see oh i've got a few fours there let's do those 922 um um i did put in an order 
um, with Syllaba for two numbers that I thought I'd got more of, but I haven't. Um, so they should be here soon. Syllaba are pretty quick. Um, it was a nice live last night. It just wasn't, they're just not as, yeah, I don't know. Anyway, I did what I needed to do. The whole purpose of the of the live was to do the update figures. Well done to everybody taking part in DIY DP. Doing a fabulous job. Oh, I've gone horribly wrong here somewhere. I don't know what I've done. So we'll do that like that. There we go. I've put too many in, I think. Do that. So that one needs to come out. What did I say the other day about how you make mistakes and then you don't spot them till later on? That is case in point. However, I think I did lay that wrong on the last colour. So that'll be why. Um, I hope that you're okay. I am looking forward to having another week where I get quite a bit done. That's right, dogs are barking. I'm just checking to make sure it's not one of the kids or anything. I don't think so. Um, so I am using the XL um, limited edition rose gold tray. Now somebody... Um, did ask last night these will be available for sale from etsy on the 1st of december they will go live then and you will have your opportunity oh hang on we've got a single arrow there let's get that one make sure we get all the all the singles um yeah you will get the opportunity to buy your trays just bear in mind though that if you do um purchase one of the trays and you ask for it to be blinged up it does take a little bit longer because i do it myself you know i do them by myself um but all told where am i now so four hundred and fifty-five thousand and ninety-five out of 125,440 so 36.35 percent so i'm more than a third done so that's good um Really now, it is just a case of just keep going. Right, I'm going to do the H's first because I've got them dotted down there. So where are you? 610. Um, I've got a friend coming to have her nails done today. Um, I had to move her because we originally booked her in and she wasn't able to make it. She had to change it. So, um, yeah. I thought, do you know what? I've got enough time to film a shortish video and get it edited and up before she gets here. Um, the room, luckily, is already set up to go. But I wanted to get changed first because I don't like sitting and working in my work clothes, in my cleaning clothes. So, um, yeah, I wanted to get that done. Um, I did have a couple of orders. They have gone out this morning. So that is done. I'm feeling, I'm feeling all right. The pain isn't too bad at the minute. Um, it's normally not too bad, providing I keep moving. Um, it's when I stop, which is why I don't want to sit here too long. Um, because I will seize up, which will be incredibly painful for when I have to sit and do her nails. So, um, yeah, I thought, you know what, I'm just gonna get on and do a quick one. Um, I have really been enjoying having a set amount. I know there isn't a daily amount set, but I do advise having a goal, I do. Otherwise, we make excuses not to do it. Um, just like I was trying to make excuses yesterday to not right so that's them too to not do the live it's like well i'm tired oh well you know do i really need to um they're just excuses <laughs> so what actually ended up happening 
Oh, what have I done? Why am I going so wrong today? Right, so those three are there. So that one's there. Yes. Okay, that's better. Um, yeah, um, what I ended up doing was I had been working on the section I was doing anyway. Um, so it just meant that I carried on and I actually did get some dotting done last night, which was nice. So any time that I can carve out for myself is a bonus. And I have been struggling recently with having enough time. Um, I think some of the problem is as well, is that I used to do a lot of my phone calls and stuff. I think that one's one as well. Um, in the car, in the old car, this car does not have Bluetooth enabled. So the only way I can make phone calls is to have earbuds in. And I don't feel very secure doing that because like, what if I don't hear an ambulance or a police car or something? You know, the one thing you don't want to miss hearing is a police car. Because <laughs> what if it's you they're after? Anyway, um, I did have a catch up with Penny today, which was lovely. She said she had a good birthday, despite everything. Um. Right, let's tick those off because I'm I'm very aware that I'm getting quite right. I've done that. Oh, they're just not they they're done. They're just not showing. That's fine. Okay, so that one there. Just had to concentrate for a minute there. Oh, what are you doing? Thank you. You know, when you're sitting there and you're trying to do something, you're thinking, why is it not working? And it's just because you haven't switched to the right mode. On that one, I didn't even pick the bloody drill up. Off to a good start. I'm already baking. Like, this room is so warm since we had the heating done. The whole house is a lot warmer. Um, so, um, there, there are some bonuses. I am looking forward to having a lovely hot bath tonight. Um, so at the minute, the main problem I have is with my sciatica. So sometimes a hot bath gives me a bit of relief. And if I then add in some ibuprofen freeze gel, gel which Ashley loves putting on because it makes me jump every time, um, and a hot water bottle. <laughs> so I just do a mix of everything, it's just like, Chucking everything at it that I can. Sucks to be me. That's all I'm going to say. Sucks to be me. But I thought, if nothing else, if I can come on and just get this section finished, I will be happy with that. And then tomorrow, um, apart from... Right, that one shouldn't be there. hate this i hate these lighter colors i really do um yeah um tomorrow i haven't got anyone in after work so i can come home and to be fair i could probably get the uh, the sofa bed down to the cabin before ashley even gets home it's fine i'll get cat to help me Right, so next one. So what have we got the most of? I think it's actually those. Yeah, definitely. So let's do the Fs first. <laughs> let's give all the Fs a go. Do, do, do. Where are you? 3371. Of course it is. Of course it's 3371. I am using... The very, very first P 
pen that I ever made. Um, somebody did ask about pens last night. As soon as I can, I promise. As soon as I can. I'm just trying not to cut into mine and my husband's time together too much. I mean, I know I've got to put the effort in, but I think I was going a little bit too, too into it before. I was sort of, I didn't realise quite how neglectful I was being. <laughs> um, so we've got into a really good habits now, which is nice. So I can go that one all the way across because I know that it's all 3371. Um, other than that, no plans really. I've just finished um, a season of of um, Great British Bake Off. So I think we're season 13, which is 2022. Yeah, we've just done 2021. Right, I need to do that. And then I need to come down these 3371. Please do not assume that my tray is rubbish and that's why they're not line, lining up. Um, they're not lining up because they're crap drills. <laughs> they're a mix of drills, should I say. They are not Diamond Art Club. So it is the drills that are cheap. Not the tray. Come on, release. Stop playing about, thank you. Um, this week um, I have my new client who I met two weeks ago. I absolutely love him. <laughs> absolutely, absolutely love him. Um, that's that one. He, um, he actually said to my boss that he really liked me. He really liked what I'd done. Very, very pleased. She then passed that on to me. So I was, of course... Over the moon, because it's always nice when you meet someone that you get on with, you know. Takes them from being just clients to being people that you actually don't mind seeing. Believe me, I have some that I'd rather not. Um, right, but at the end of the day, it is, it is the cleaning job that's paying my part of the bills, so I can't knock it too much. There we go. Excellent. Right, so I'm going to go back in and I'm just going to make, get these H's marked off again. There we go. Oh. You know, like when you're trying so desperately hard to do something that you, you do it too well. And you, you skip past what you're meant to be doing. That was me just there. So I cannot wait until Sunday to find out how everyone's got on this week. Hopefully you are having a good run at it. Um, can we highlight those please? 632. Thank you very much. Where are you? 632. There we go. Um because I'm quite pleased with what I've got done. It's going to be interesting when I get onto this bottom bit, because this bottom row, it's literally like 15 drills high, I think. Is it 15? I think it's 16 but I think one of those drills I won't do I will probably just do the 10 I need to double check um, and see what I actually did it as and I do have a video thank god that will tell me is that right 632 yeah 
Um, yeah, I have got a video from where I set up before I started this canvas. So um, I'll be able to go back and have a look at that. Because I know I wouldn't have done 16. So it's either... I will probably do 15. I might even just do 10 if I've got enough. I'll have to have a look. It's it's an easy fix. It's an easy check. Put it that way. Oh, for God's sake. Thank you. I apologise to anyone who's religious. For me, taking the Lord's name in vain and all that sort of stuff. Just have it. There we go. Um, so yeah, my evening will now consist of doing my friend's nails. I think she's got, she's one of them people she's always doing stuff, like literally every weekend and during the week. You know, she's one of them people, what are you doing? Oh, I've got this, 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 this and this. She's like that. How she's got the energy, I don't know. It's like if I go out on a Saturday, I need Sunday and Monday to get over it. But she's always doing something. So I think she's having her nails done for some event that she's attending. And I'm desperately trying to not book my Mondays because um, I like to have that as a whole day off. Especially if I am doing a live as well. So I've just got to try and try and make sure that I don't, you know, I've got three nights in a week where people can come and have the nails done if they want. The problem is, is when you're just doing it for friends and family, sometimes you let them, you let, you let them sway you a bit when you should actually be saying no. Just going to turn my double sided tape around. It seems to not be very sticky. So I'm just going to give it a bit of a squish. And it's probably just because it's pushed down too far in the bit stickier. And you watch now, it'll be it'll be too sticky. That always happens. <laughs> what I did laugh about. Um, Ignore that noise. Um, Penny did say that in one of the videos she was watching the other day, I'd left my vape in sight. Um, I need to say, I don't actually use my vape very much. Most of the time, I just move it around room to room. So if you do happen to see my vape, I've literally had like four puffs on it in the last three days. I'm honestly pretty much almost off it. So if you do see it laying around, don't assume that I'm actually using it because most of the time it's just there as a safety net pretty much right that one oh it's nice now because we're just down to them last two colours um, also on the live last night, we had one of one of our new beginners, new new conversion fans. Um, she was saying that she's already she's gone and purchased all the drills for the Rivendell picture, like I've got. Do you know what I mean by the Rivendell picture? If not, I'll show you. Let's go out of there. Okay. This is my, my, oh, that's not it. Let's get the mock-up. This is my Rivendell picture. Um, th this is the chart that I got off Etsy. And one, I showed this on the live. And one of the people taking part in DIY DP went and bought it. She's already ordered all of the drills from Evermoment. I would love to do that. <laughs> it's a beautiful picture. I cannot wait. I've also got Moria. Gates of Moria. 
Um, so yeah, she's already ordered all of the drills and I would love to do that because it would be so nice to actually do a conversion where you've got all the drills of the same quality because it does make a difference. What did I say about my tape being too sticky now? Um, oh, what did, oh, I moved it. Go back. Come on, Sam, sort yourself out. What are you doing? Right, done those. That's because I've come out of it. So I've done all of those. Right, I've done those. So it's just, I've done those. And that one. And that one. It's just these two. Um, yeah. Um, maybe one day, but I'm hoping because as time goes on, um, most of the drills that I've got in my spare drill storage now are Diamond Eye Art Club. So eventually it will be a long time before I get on to doing mine, put it that way. A long, long time. Um, I do have a cheap version of Ribbon Rivendell. All completed. I got it from Fan Cells years ago. Um, it just, I loved it at the time, but it's just not, it's just not detailed enough. So it's not good enough to put up on the wall. Although I will, of course, have my Lord of the Ring canvases from Diamond Art Club arriving soon. Come on, why aren't you? Sometimes, I hate this app. Sometimes, it just, it drives me mad. Because I'm trying my hardest. <laughs> it's just not being very reactive. <sighs> there we go, 704. Which I actually stole out of a Diamond Art Club kit yesterday. Because they're the ones I've ordered. They should be here soon though. So I will replace them. Um, I do need to get out. Um, a canvas and get that kitted up as well. Because I want to do that one soon. Because um, I want it for my bedroom. So may have to forego voting. But we shall see. Um, so while I fill this in. On these bits. Um, thank you for joining me for this video. I know it's a short one. Um, I hope that you've had an opportunity to do a little bit of diamond painting today. That you took a little bit of time out to spend for yourself. Um, bit of luck. There will be a video. There will be no video tomorrow. Um, and with a bit of luck, there will be a video for you on Thursday. But I'm not promising just in case. I mean, this should be the video. <laughs> this should be the video that goes up today. So um, I'd rather get this one up today and miss Thursday if necessarily. But we'll see. It may be that tomorrow um, I get time to film for Thursday and Friday. So we'll, we'll play it by ear. We'll see what happens. See what happens. Hopefully, by the time we get to that video, I will have got my drills by then because um, they are quite quick. And I wish I had something interesting to tell you, but I really don't have anything. I'm literally work and home. It's that time of year. I think it's that time of year where those of us with with, you know, chronic pain conditions we kind of struggle the most um, I know I'm not the only one having a fibro flare or arthritis playing up or Ash is also having trouble with his with his joints so um, I'm not alone 
and uh, yeah I will see you soon um, don't forget if you are taking part your cut off to give updated figures is Sunday at 12 noon GMT um, and also all I need is your latest figures so total drills laid so far your total dr drills for the canvas and your percentage I can work out what it is this week that sort of thing don't don't panic too much oh, she says if i can ever get this bloody drill i knew it because this is what happens stop sticking so you turn it round and then it 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 sticks to everything okay but that's my section done so that's something um so thank you very much i hope that you've enjoyed um please do keep drilling um every little bit that you do now is a little bit less that you have to do later um that now puts me at four so before i go i'm gonna pop my next sections into view like so because it locks them in and uh, yeah i will see you soon for another video it is as always over and out from this kit lock kitten